What you'll find in most uh, single blade razors, which typically are modern safety razors, you're really forcing the shaver to hold the blade themselves in a precise location and geometry and angle. What we were trying to do was address some of that learning curve and at the same time not compromise on the quality of the shave with a single blade razor at all. You need to provide some surface that you can actually feel against your face and combine that with a spring-loaded pivot, essentially a suspension. We started to look at what that surface might look and feel like, looking at how large it would need to be, um, what allowed you to feel it more, and we started to dial in the combination of that surface the reference surface itself, the amount that the blade protruded from it. If you look at the pivot on the razor, your angle of your arm or your hand is going to change. What the pivot and the suspension that's hidden within the razor is allowing is for a consistent feel and relationship of the reference surface to your changing face geometry and also your changing arm angles or hand angles as you move around your face. What we're really trying to do more than anything is provide a consistent feeling as you're shaving and the ability to, in a very simple way, maintain the position of the surface and the angle of the blade against your face, no matter what the angle of your hand is. And so as long as that pivot is engaged and there's some flex within it, you know that the reference surface is riding on your face in the right geometry.